that we take one minute of silence to pay tribute to the elephants whose lives have been lost so brutally and so unnecessarily. We are here to give a voice to elephants, to urge our political leaders and world leaders to take immediate action to protect the species, to stop the killing, to end the trade in ivory. We need more boots on the ground, enhanced security, stricter sentencing for people who trade in ivory. We'd like to call on China's leaders to ban the trade of ivory. Elephants are killed for their ivory, which has long been banned by international law. So the only access to ivory is through illegal poaching in Africa. The elephants are the great ambassadors of terrestrial ground. Lose them and we lose a direct line of communication with nature forever. We cannot ever afford to tell the children of the future, this is where the wild things were. This elephant crisis is too big for any one of us. If we're going to succeed to save the elephants, we have to be together. And this is the most amazing demonstration I've seen today. The more we learn about elephants, the more incredible we, things we discover about them. And just as we're beginning to realize they are such emotional, compassionate, extraordinary creatures, is at a time when they're actually plummeting towards extinction. Stop any use for ivory. Yeah. Let's leave ivory for the elephants. There's a reason why God wanted it to be an elephant. Today marks the single largest public gathering of support for a wild animal. We need to support the people on the ground. We need to support the Dave Sheldrick Wildlife Trust. There's so many people doing such good work and really putting their lives on the line to do this. And we're here and we're able to support them. Anything you give is so appreciated. And even more important, your voices. that we've been able to rescue, and for every one rescue, there are probably another hundred.